Welcome friends in the next uh, lecture of ETHAB series lectures level 1 and 4th lecture in this lecture we are going to discuss more about the uh, in a file menu about the option of data exchange so what's data exchange? Uh, I have one question in another uh, software for example we take it as a MATLAB in MATLAB uh, can you open a file of power system analyst in PSCAT? One file, one project uh, is in PSCAT. Uh, can you find it that PSCAT file in MATLAB uh, to uh, analyze it in MATLAB for further modifications? Of course, no. This option is available in. Uh, ETHAP. In ETHAP we have uh, some external files we want to open in ETHAP. ETHAP will use some uh, database conversion to convert the data of uh, another uh, projects uh, prepared in another softwares uh, to use it for further modifications or for further analysis in MATLAB. Hence, uh, data exchange in MATLAB, uh, data exchange in uh, ETAB means to exchange the data of uh, another softwares to exchange it to convert it uh, for ETAB files for ETAB projects. Now, for example, uh, we have uh, a pre uh, prepared a project in PSCAD I want to open that uh, prepared PSCAD project file in ETAP to analyze to use the data we go uh, on file then data exchange we go for importing uh, the files uh, from SKM project or uh, whatever we want Another software, for example, is Easy uh, Power. Uh, we have one project in Easy Power. We want to use that project data for uh, ETAP. Then we can import from here. Uh, and step by step, we start discussing each one of these uh, importing and exporting the data. But uh, uh, first of all, we should know that how many categories, how many levels of data exchange between uh, ETAB and another softwares are available. We discuss it and we return again in data exchange. Uh, we have three levels of uh, data exchange between um, uh, external softwares and another data and ETAB. Uh, the first level is importing data into an ETAB project. Uh, we have an external uh, uh, predefined file, uh, pre prepared project in another software. Uh, then uh, the ETAB database will convert it to use for ETAB. This is importing data into an ETAB project. The next one is uh, uh, levels, uh, second level is one-way synchronization of data. One-way synchronization of data means that uh, we uh, add some modifications on the converted data. Uh, first, uh, we have uh, a file in another project. We use that data, uh, data mapping, then it comes to the ETAB data exchange and here we have user confirmations and adding some modifications on the data and continuously uh, circulating the data and using that data for uh, ETHA project. And the third one is uh, uh, two-way synchronization of data. In two-way synchronization of data, we continuously we uh, uh, can take uh, the data from external the project and add the modifications and 
this circulation will continue as we require. We learned these three uh, levels of data exchange. Now uh, let's see uh, practically the data exchange in ETHAP. We start go to file and data exchange. In data exchange we have import from clipart. Uh, import status confirmation. It says configuration, sorry. Uh, import from clipart and import status configurations. We'll discuss in this lecture. Uh, both. I started from uh, one of the question. In another softwares, uh, we select some portions of uh, the data, for example, this portion we select. Then we click it, we copy this portion, then we go and create a new project maybe. I add some names. For example, do we give a uh, random name? Okay, uh, we have this description simple to get as a simple to username. Okay, new project with uh, my defined name has opened. Here, I want to um, copy it, uh, paste it, sorry from uh, that project. Hence, we don't have the option of the paste here. How can I uh, transfer that data here? Uh, here we are discussing about how to do Here we select uh, that portion of our required data. Yeah, now we have selected all. Uh, by copying and paste it will not work even it works in uh, subnetwork for example I take uh, a copy of uh, uh, this portion diagrams and paste it in side of the subnetwork but the connections will miss and some of the uh, uh, ratings will change now uh, we selected this portion go to the file exchange data export to the clay part first export this one you export it now we open our uh, project uh, before we had another project of to where it was this is our project two three. Yeah, we are gonna open. Yes. Yeah. Now in here, we can't use the paste option. We exported that data to the clipart, go to the file, exchange, import from clipart. Now it is imported from the clipart. This sign uh, exactly shows it is coming from the clipart. And these are the ratings of our diagram. This is the way how we uh, exchange the data between the projects of ETHAB itself from the clay part option and uh, same as this in uh, importing from another uh, projects uh, prepared by another softwares. In the next lecture we are gonna discuss about the status configurations importing and exporting and importing objects and exporting the objects.